What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel, the Subi fam. We got my boy Noah here today with us. He's got his clean ass FA right there. We're gonna get some more than that on the channel soon. We're gonna be taking Sylvie. We're gonna go grab some ethanol so then we can, you know, obviously get some more ethanol in Scooby and start enjoying Scooby a little bit and get a video for you guys. So let's jump into it. Crap. Woo. How's she smell? Good. <laughs> All right, guys. So we just pulled up to the to the gas station. E's getting cheaper, man. That's not bad at all. I'll take that all day. Tell me not. Oh yeah. All fucking day, baby. So not bad. We'll show you guys what we're looking at. We brought five five gallons with us, so we're getting ready for spring, baby. Hell yeah. Too bad this bitch ain't getting the E. Let me know. Drop, drop, the, drop it in the comments, guys. Let me know if you think Sylvie should get some meat. It does look nice over here. All right, guys. So not bad. It ended up being about... No, what? About 100... 110, I'd say, no? 115? But 115 bucks, guys, not bad at all. So let's let's head back to the crib. Let's, you know, get this stuff in the garage, put some ethanol in Scooby, and get to it. All right, guys, so we got about a 35 minute trip back to, the, back to the crib. So we'll catch you then. So we just pulled up back. We got the ethanol, nice and strapped in. We got our four jugs, we got one in the back trunk. We got my boy Noah's WRX here looking super, super clean. We're gonna give it a little cold start for you guys. It's a daily, you already know. So, so clean. Let me know what you guys think about this build, guys. The headlights, super, super clean. You already know he's getting it hooked up with the Subi fam. Clean. I can't wait to see this thing slammed. He's already got coils for it. Let me know. Let me know in the comments, guys. What do you guys think? All right, guys, so the garage is a mess, but we gotta get the jugs in here. So we got four jugs right there. We're gonna start, you know, we'll put this jug in Scooby because it's at about a half a tank, I'm pretty sure. So that should make it full. We'll see what content she's at. Let's get this. All right, guys, so fast forward a few days. We did actually bag the STI. It's still a freaking, it's still a dream in my head, but we're gonna get a cold start for you guys. But yeah, guys, it's literally still like a dream come true. Like, I, I absolutely can't believe it, but let's get the STI started. We're gonna get a pop video for you guys, you know, finish the video out. I'm excited to get this thing started. We got, we got her on full E85 again, so let's get to it.
guys. So, that's day I just warmed up. We got, what this thing is on airlift performance, like I just said, literally a dream come true, but I'm gonna show you guys our preset ride. This is our preset ride right now. This is what we ride at. For that, we literally just double hit the middle button and she goes at the preset ride. We got 45s in the front and then 68 in the back. Usually when I'm riding alone, that's that's perfect. She doesn't rub at all. But sometimes with people, I do have to lift her up a little bit, I've noticed. But this thing is at 487 to the crank, guys, on the FP Blue setup on straight 85. And the bags feel great. They really do. We got the white line sway bars in now. We got the coil rad radiator. So I'm, I'm excited to start really enjoying this car. The car makes 350 wheel horsepower in sport and 409 in sport sharp. Yeah, I mean, we, I live in New England and these these roads, especially where I live, they're, they're shit. And the bags are handling amazing. They're taking the potholes pretty well. Obviously, I'm not, you know, slamming massive ones, but they're taking them pretty well. A lot better than I expected. Feels good to drive this car again, man. We've pretty much had her tucked away almost all winter. Being on E, can't, obviously can't even get her started around us, but the weather's starting to get better. We're gonna start enjoying this thing again, getting more pop videos for you guys. So make sure you stay in tune to the channel. freaking amazing so smooth now cooling temps will be will be great now with the coil rad glad we did that a lot of construction going on I do have to figure out because we got the the wooden trunk set up back there the cedar wood you know with the tank on it but when I hit bigger bumps it bounces around a little bit so I got to figure a way figure out a way to secure that better but literally other than that I'm so freaking happy with the way things are feeling and how the setups setups going it drives so smooth it can still you know I've, I've given it the sport sharp 487 to the crank with my pops actually and the bags they handled well they handled super super well so much better than i freaking expected that's for sure we'll give her a little pull here in sport feels good feels really really good It's so freaking good to drive this car again. Even in just in sport, it feels absolutely killer. Oh. I love the tunnels, guys. Sick. This thing's internal wastegate too, guys. Oh. Let me roll up the windows here. I 
wish you guys could see my face. I'm gonna have to get a camera on the other side because, man, so much joy, so much freaking joy. It's so good to drive this car again. I'm so happy we're getting into the springtime, summertime's coming, baby. I got a few more plans coming for this build too. Remember guys, we got so much content coming on so many different builds. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. Oh, it feels good to drive this again. The FP Blue feels awesome. Feels great. put her in sports sharp yet there's no need I enjoy daily in this thing in freaking sport the FV Blue it does it gives you that different feeling man it, it hits so much harder than the stock turbo this thing feels great right now 50 degree weather on E you know for something around 400 to the wheels you could do bags I'd recommend it it feels great shifting that one fuck it's been a while guys holy shit that was bad though that felt like crap bad shifting on my part the subi felt great it took too long Still in the stock clutch too, guys, by the way. She's holding up. Give it one more little pull here in sport. I don't want to abuse on the car too much yet today. I love this car, guys. this car so much I want a Hawkeye guy so bad stay tuned to the channel it's gonna happen guys we're gonna call it here we're gonna be dropping more pop videos so all right guys so we're gonna call it here we're gonna be dropping more pop videos soon so make sure you stay tuned to the channel like the video subscribe to the channel do it all up i hope you guys are enjoying what we're, what's going on what we're doing to the build oh my god it's crazy we're like right there on the floor kidding me are you freaking kidding me that's not even all the way aired out either that's just preset low it's about 20 20 psi in each bag it looks freaking killer man i cannot believe it 
it's literally so good to be you know finally enjoying the car again after all winter living in new england definitely kind of sucks but you know like i said it makes you appreciate the cars more when you're not really driving them every day but i'm super excited to be you know getting to the warmer weather be able to enjoy this thing make more videos for you guys she's looking absolutely amazing now that she's on air she drives amazing i love it guys Remember, we do have the wife's STI, which we were driving at the beginning of the video. So we will be, you know, giving her some more love, getting some more parts on her. But I'm super, super happy with the way this thing's come out. This thing needs tint 110%. We do have a few other mods, you know, that I'm going to be doing. I've been wanting to do, but I love it. All right, guys, if you want to catch more on this build, make sure you're liking the video, subscribe to the channel. Subi fam out, baby.